And to the others he said, in mine hearing, go ye after him through the city and smite. Let not your eye spare, neither have ye pity. And that's what the Lord said that's going to happen to the rest of our people that ain't got that mark of exemption upon their head in, this, in these last days, meaning the mark of exemption, meaning the mark that you're not going to get judged, man, pretty much. You've got the, the truth of the Lord, who you are, knowing that you're an Israelite, knowing who your enemy is, knowing what's to come, knowing this truth, basically, to you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. But the Lord said, and to the others, meaning the rest of our people, he said in mine hit to the others who said in mine hearing, go ye after him through the city and smite. Let not your eyes spare, neither have ye pity. Meaning, the rest of our people are going to get judged in that day, man. The Lord's going to put the spirit on these men. Okay, the men that prophet prophesying this word, teaching this word, is going to give us the power to put two third of our people to death. They ain't got this mark, man. He's going to give us the power, man, to judge, to bring judgment upon the earth, man. But it's all going to start through our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai. Okay, in the world, even who is Jesus Christ. But the Lord said we're going to be joint heirs with him. He's going to give us power to, 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 to tread the wicked, man. So our two-thirds of our people, they're going to be destroyed in these last days, man. For not adhering to righteousness, man. Okay, so that's what the Lord said. He said, slay utterly, old and young. Meaning, the Lord, if, they, if they're, if they're, if they're um, marked to be destroyed, slay them. If they're set up to be destroyed, slay them, old and young. No matter if it's young, because you've got young gremlins. Old elderly gremlins man okay old and young both maids meaning women and little children this is what the bible says and women and women okay old and young okay maids and little children and women so you see so lord hey, you fucking women you're gonna get judged in these last days as well these lesbian dyke bitches okay these w these wicked men out here you're all gonna be fucking destroyed man those that neglect the lord your and shy, you're gonna be destroyed man Okay, that, 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 that worship this system, worship this way of life, the way of life of the so-called white man, these Edomites, you're going to be destroyed, man, following these devils. Okay, it says, and, to wi and women, but come not near any man upon whom is the mark, and begin at my sanctuary. Then they began at the ancient men which were before the house. So it said, but come not near any man upon whom is the mark. So the ones of our people that have this mark, of Yahbash and Yahshai, this knowledge, this understanding, this truth, the Lord's going to spare them in that day, man. But two-thirds of our people, you're going to be caught up in this destruction, man, because you adhere to this wickedness. You see, this in that advert, com the advert uh, for this program, there was Jake men in there, Jake women, okay, adhe adhered to this homosexual lifestyle, man, bisexual, homosexual lifestyle. Women, men and women of our people, man. So the Lord's going to judge them in these last days for that, man. Okay, he says, but come not near any man upon whom is the mark, meaning the mark exempt from judgment, all right? That, that's the brothers that, the elect, that are going to have the mark. We're going to be exempt from judgment, Lord willing, you know, of that number, the elected, okay? And begin at my sanctuary, meaning begin at the house of Israel, man. Begin with the so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, all right? Begin at my sanctuary. Then they began at the ancient men which were before the house. So that's the, when the Lord gives these men that judgment, that power to judge. Look, man, a lot of people are going to get put to death because the Lord's going to give these men spiritual power, man, heavenly power. And are gonna, we're going to have power beyond what you can, what we can even imagine right now. But the Lord's going to give these men spiritual power to execute judgments on the planet Earth, man. Heavenly power, man. But it's going to start with our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, first, whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, which is a black man. Yahweh Shai, his name's Yahweh Shai, which is a black man. He's going to come so-called black man, right, which is what you'd call him on the Earth today which is from the tribe of Judah, he's going to come and execute judgment. And he's going to give these men the power to do it as well, man. Because this world's all out of order. It's wicked, okay? And these wicked elite, so-called white men, elite Edomites, they're pushing their wicked agenda on the planet Earth. And the Lord's just about to ready to destroy this place because the prophecies are being fulfilled, man. World War Three's around the corner. They're going to release the RFID chip soon. The mark of the beast is going to be implemented on the planet Earth. So we're here, we're at the door of our Lord and Saviour's return, man, because this world is getting all out of whack and it needs to be put back in its righteous order, man. And it's going to be through Yahweh Shai, whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, which is a so-called black man, right? From the tribe of Judah, and his name's Yahweh Shai. He's going to come and establish his kingdom on this planet Earth, man. All right, and do away with all this fucking wickedness. Okay, so with that, I'm just going to say, all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai. 
Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and Shalom to the Akim that teach in this word. Shalom Yahweh, Hashem Yahweh Shai, Hashem Makakwadash. Shalom, Shalom.